over hundreds of kilometers. What about seismic risk, maintenance, emergency response at jetliner speeds, and the cost? A 60-kilometer test track alone could cost 10 billion U.S. dollars. Scaling to full routes like Beijing-Shanghai may demand up to 300 billion U.S. dollars. And then there's trust. Will the West adopt Chinese maglev tech? Unlikely. Amid rising tech tensions and cybersecurity concerns, China may instead focus on BRI countries where it already holds influence. Years, China went from idea to prototype to a train reaching 623 kilometers per hour. The goal, 1,000 kilometers per hour by 2030. If achieved, it won't just be a win for engineering. It'll redefine transportation, global supply chains, and geopolitical power. While the U.S. debates regulations and Europe hesitates on infrastructure, China builds. The real question now isn't can they do it, but rather, when will the rest of the world catch up? What do you think? Is China building the future or heading toward an expensive gamble? Let us know in the comments. And if you want to see more stories like this, subscribe to Future Structure Official. This isn't just news, it's the future unfolding, one breakthrough at a time.